And we are back. Last time I was here, I went over there and there was a leviathan camping the front of it because the developers who make this game are awful people. Thankfully, he didn't eat me. Uh, but yeah, we went over there, got some stuff. Honestly, it's been a hot minute, so I don't totally remember. But what I do remember, and wow, that actually looks super cool from... Uh, from up here, but regardless, what I do remember is that I got a Seamoth module that would make it so that... What the hell is this? Anyways, oh my god, I didn't even sort out the shit I got. I have like a hundred batteries still in the power cell. Alright, well, I know I got a depth module for my Seamoth. I don't remember how deep it lets me go, though. So, let me actually take a look at that first. I can now go down to 300 meters from, I think, 200. And the Degasi habitat is at 250. So maybe I can go down there. But there is one specific goal I have today. And it's that I absolutely need to make a gun. The gun needs to be made. And in order to get the gun, I need magnetite. And because some jackass in my DMs spoiled the, you know, game for me again, thanks by the way, I don't remember who it was, stop giving me info. Please. I know you're trying to help, but stop telling me things. Anyways, they told me that I could find magnetite in the Jelly Shroom Caves. And last time, I saw some jellyfish-looking mushrooms. So I can only assume that's where I need to go. If I'm wrong, then I'm about to go over there and wander around in circles for like 30 minutes and not find anything. But I have a good feeling that's where I need to go, or more so where I can go, so that's the plan. I'm gonna head over to what I can only assume is those jelly shroom caves, and hopefully I can find some stuff in there. One thing that I will say was weird was that it's not that far from here, and my scanner room couldn't find any magnetite. So, you know, that's maybe a little bit worrying, but nah, it is what it is. Oh, right, and I also got that upgrade for the propulsion cannon called the Repulsion Cannon, which applies percussive force to entities in range. Um, and I mean, I'm kind of interested to get that, just seeing if I can blast away sharks and stuff. That just seems like it could be handy, uh, but I need magnetite for it. Just like I, how I need magnetite for the gun. I need magnetite for friggin' everything, alright? So I gotta find magnetite. <laughs> this sucks. 12 seconds later. Alright, so minor problem. I've been wandering around for a little bit. I don't know if I've not gone far enough or what, but I can't find the entrance. So, that's a good sign. Rather than wandering around finding it eventually and then having to wander around again, I'm gonna grow some brains and go back and get a beacon. That way when I do find it, I won't be blind the next time I'm looking. I've got myself my beacon, so the search is back on. I don't think this is it. Oh wait, no, this, I mean, that looks like the correct biomarker, almost. I think this is it. This was stupid easy to find. I'm an idiot. I'm still gonna put the marker here just in case, though, because I don't want to lose this again. I've already lost it once, I don't need to lose it again. We've got magnetite to find, so it's time for adventure. I am a little bit worried that this is going to go deeper than my Seamoth can still go. Because I'm already at 150, which is half of my max depth. And we're like, not even close. <laughs> That's not... It's not great. I don't really know what's down here. I haven't seen anything. And it didn't talk about it being any sort of ecological dead zone or anything like last time. So like... What the fuck is that? Thanks. What are those things? They're like worms swimming in and out of the 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 little mushroom things. Yeah, those are fish. That right there is it's like an eyeball. It's a floating eyeball. I hope those things don't eat me. Those, like, worm things, I, I really, very hesitant to go near. I'm less scared of them than the Leviathan, but it doesn't make me any more comfortable that they exist. They don't look like they're big enough to do any real damage to my Seamoth. I hope they're not big enough to do any real damage to my Seamoth. 
Oh, I hate going in new areas. I hate it so much. I need a scanner room or something down here, but even if I had one, I can't make the HUD chip to show me where the stuff is without friggin' magnetite. <laughs> Who made this game? What's wrong with you? Is that, that's magnetite right there, right? That's two magnetites. I don't want to get eaten, but I am going to get out to grab the magnetite. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. I know, I know, I know, I know, I know, I know. That's two magnetite, baby, that's progress. I think it's enough for my gun. I very uneasy going towards these <laughs> these mushrooms. I just wanted magnetite and I found it, but I feel like I'm gonna need more. So if I just stop here, then I'm not gonna have enough magnetite later. Probably, I assume. I really hope those things don't attack me. They definitely do. It said predatory life forms and the only thing I've seen that could be predatory are those things. Everything else seems pretty tame. It's a bunch of fish. Unless the fish like eat you, but other than the biter fish, I don't think so. Is that more magnetite? Fuck, dude. It's right below the mushrooms these guys keep coming out of. You have gotta be kidding me. I don't like it, I don't like it, I don't like it, I don't like it. Get me back in there. All right, we've got, oh, there's more. Uh, you gotta be kidding me. I need to take this stuff. I can't just not. I'm, I think what I'm gonna do, they don't seem very fast. So I think what I'm gonna do is see if I can piss one of those off. Give me that. Oh fuck, my camera's bugged. Nope, 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 nope. Ooh, what is that? I don't know. So I think what I'll do is I'll piss one of these off and I'll see if it tries to kill me. Um, that's my plan. Hey asshole. What the fuck is that? That thing's really loud and it just gave me the chills. I want to piss one of these off. I don't want to run into them though. Are they like inside of it? One of them went inside of one of these. And I can see inside of them. Oh, he came out. Hey asshole. You, yeah, I'm gonna hit you. Yeah, how do you like that? Okay, I don't think they, I don't think they kill me. Not in my, uh, not in my, my sea moth. Damn, you're a mean son of a bitch. Oh yeah, he does attack my sea moth. It only does like 83, it only did like 15 damage though. I feel a lot better about that, but I still don't like you. You're a bit of a dickhead, you know that? You just ate the fish, you monster. All right, it seems like I need to do a fair amount to really piss those guys off. Like, he only started really coming after me after I got super close and ran into him. But for right now, I want my gun. So, uh, we'll leave looking around the rest of this for a later day. But it seems since I can outrun them, and since they're little bitches and they don't attack me unless I get really close, I should just be able to ignore them most of the time, I'm pretty sure. Jesus fucking Christ. Ah, oh, that still gets me. We are back at home with magnetite in hand. I managed to snag four of them, which is infinitely more than I had before. I know I needed two for the gun, and I needed like one for, um, I don't even remember what it was. Oh yeah, the HUD ship for the scanner room. So hopefully, since I can, I imagine move the HUD ship from scanner room to scanner room because it looked like it was a removable module. I should only ever need one and I'll just have to build extra scanner rooms. I hope. But I need a computer chip, titanium, a battery which I've got, and two magnetite which I've got. And then I can make the stasis rifle. And then I'll have completed the goal for today and I'll go shoot some stuff. And then we'll probably do something else because that won't be enough time. So I desperately need copper. I have basically none of it. I'm actually pretty sure I have literally none of it. So I think what I ought to do is actually go farm some copper just in general. So I have a bunch of it and we've done this before. And last time I obviously didn't get enough copper. So this time we're gonna go out again and try to get enough copper. I mean, I don't know what else to say. That's the goal. So I'll be back with some copper in a minute. Whoa, what the fuck? What the hell are you doing in here? No, don't shit in the cave. Oh, come on, you're not supposed to be in here. Look, he's so confused. Have I ever scanned one of these guys? I don't think I have. Fucking gas pod. He's panicking, he's just running into the wall and taking a bunch of shits. 
God damn it, man. I'm just trying to get resources. So why you gotta make my life difficult? What the fuck? That's one of those shitheads, but he's sideways. This is a terrible idea. Oh my god, I killed it! <laughs> get destroyed, dumbass! I killed him before he even came out because he was sideways. You can trust me when I say that those things have been making farming resources a real pain in the ass. So that, that was good. I like, I like that a lot. Okay, so I filled up my inventory. We got a bunch of tot copper, a fair amount of titanium, a few silver, a gold, some sulfur, and I was running out of water, I think, so I grabbed some fish as well. Um, but I mean, that's probably not going to be enough copper for later, but it's enough copper for right now, and... That's good enough. Ideally, when I get the HUD chip for that scanner room, since it can scan for limestone chunks, I'm hoping that I, it would just show me where all the limestone is and then I won't have to wander around. Here we go, boys. Go, go, gadget gun. I finally have it. How effective it will be. I mean, I suppose we're going to find out. Boy, oh boy, do I like having a gun. Now, how do I shoot it? Oh. Hmm? Crank McGill crash landed in the acid swamps of Boreal 9, fought off arachnid kidney poachers, and hijacked a tame Star War. What the if hell's a Star War? You can survive one more day. Thanks. Okay, but I wanna I wanna shoot one of these. Ah! <laughs> Got him! You're stuck! Oh, okay, he's not stuck for very long. I just went and took a look at the PDA entry for the stasis rifle, and it said you can hold it down, and it will make it so that things will be stuck for longer, and the radius is bigger. So before you go in the comments and yell at me, I went and read the directions, and oh my god! <laughs> Anything in there is getting stuck, and I don't get stuck. Look at that! I could probably stab a shark to death in that amount of time. They're stuck forever! Oh, look at my little silhouette with the gun. <laughs> I gotta go find a shark and shoot him. I want to stab a shark to death. Hey, come get me, asshole. Yeah, yeah, I'm not afraid of you. Oh, I should have been. Ow! Come here, bitch. You oh. <laughs> oh, what's wrong, buddy? Does that hurt? Did I kill him already? No way is he dead, right? I'm not even hitting him, but he's sinking. I think he's dead. I think I killed him. <laughs> Get fucking owned. I picked up a bunch. Oh my god, I'm gonna drown. Oh my god. <laughs> I almost drowned. I was too, I'm too much fun shooting shit. Well, listen, if I can kill sharks that fast, I'm almost not even afraid of anything. I could stab anything to death at this point. I could probably stab one of those stupid leviathans to death. I'm gonna be a menace to society. I want to kill one of these things. How many hits does it take to kill one of you fuckers? Time to find out. Die, bitch! <laughs> oh my god, he died so fast! I'm a menace to society. I'm gonna kill everything. I do foresee one small problem with the uh, with this whole gun idea uh, And it's what if I miss? What the hell? Oh, it's in my inventory. <laughs> that threw me for such a loop. Um, but I suppose I'm here now, so I might as well finish what I was talking about. Uh, last night, or maybe it's, is it still nighttime? Nah, it's getting light out. Last night, I decided that I wanted to have the scanner room HUD upgrade, so I went and got all the stuff for that. And I also decided that the scanner room, the last time I used it, I think I left it out of my video, but... It was running out of power while I was using it, and that worried me because I literally almost ran my base out of power. I'm not sure what would have happened if that happened, but I was still worried. So I threw an extra solar panel, hoping that it would make the base charge faster. And not only did it make the base charge faster, but it gave me more total power, which is badass. So I've got that up and running, uh, which is really damn good. 
very happy with that. And now I know if I need more base power, I can always just put another solar panel or get one of those other generators that I've gotten. But anyways, I've got the HUD chip now. I think what I'm probably gonna do is scan for wrecks because at some point I wanna get a power cell charger. I mean, I have to assume that exists and I just keep burning through power cells and I don't have any way of charging them. Like there's an empty one in here. There's probably another empty one in one of these boxes. I don't know what I, yeah, here's another one that has 4%. And like my Seamoth is gonna run out of power if I can't charge it and I have to constantly make them. That's a bit of a pain. So we just hit 150 max power. I'm gonna search for Rex. It's probably gonna bring me to a bunch of the ones that I've already been to. Okay, so I just spent about 40 years. I've been playing for a long ass time now. Definitely my longest recording. Farming up some materials. I've got a bunch of stuff. I mathed out exactly how much materials I need to make a scanner room, a way to get in the scanner room, uh, solar power for the scanner room, and obviously I got my HUD chip, as well as I crafted up a beacon. So, we should be good to go. I'm gonna go out that way towards where the, uh, the scary leviathan was and scan for wrecks. And hopefully, I mean, ideally, I can find some stuff that I haven't already found. And if I can't, then I can pick up the scanner room and all the stuff in it, and it will refund a fair amount of my materials. Not all of them, but a decent amount. So, yeah, that's my game plan. That's what we're gonna go with, and we'll see if we can find anything. And that's probably where I'm gonna end things off, because, like I said, I've been here a hot minute. I don't know exactly how much range the scanner room really has. It didn't seem like it was that much with the default, like, no upgrades. And so honestly, crafting one of those range upgrades might be worthwhile, especially if I can move it from scanner room to scanner room. Um, I'm realizing that after I've already left. <laughs> Good going me. And now that I'm thinking on it, maybe it might be honestly better not to put it where this stuff was. I hope I can find it. There was, beforehand I'd found this like, forest where there were these rays and you guys didn't see it because I had to cut it out of the video um, because the audio broke so obviously I wasn't going to leave it in if there was no audio but yeah I was over there and I couldn't really find anything of note but if I can scan for stuff over there then I can definitely find things of note so if I can find that then that's definitely where I'm going to want to throw down my second scanner room but if I can't find that then so be it. This looks like the trench where I found some of that magnetite last. I could try to put it over here. I think to the left is where the leviathans are at. And I don't even know if I've gone this way. I don't think I have. This is towards the... This is towards, like, the island where those Degasi survivors were at. So, I mean, it goes down real deep. <laughs> I can't say I'm a huge fan. This might be... Like, this shelf right here might be the strat. Like, put it here. What the hell is that? Is that a wreck? Oh, fuck! Please tell me it didn't see me. Okay! Not that way. Hi, Leviathan. <laughs> Holy shit! It really did almost sneak up on me. I didn't even hear anything, and then he was just- he was just there. I think there's a wreck down there, but I don't see how I'm supposed to get it with Mr. Leviathan camping it. Fuck me. So this, as you can see, I just went to go check to see if my mic was muted. I'm so paranoid. This, as you can see, is like the land of... It was like relative safety. These guys didn't attack me, which was surprising. And like, I just didn't get murdered over here. So I think this is... I think this is the strat. I'm gonna put the scanner room up on this cliff here, I think and uh, we'll see what it can find. I think that's a good good plan. I don't remember if it starts... Yeah, yeah, I've got oxygen now, don't worry. Okay, it starts at zero power. Not ideal. Look at this, though. Big-ass cliff, and we're right on the edge of it. This is honestly a really cool kind of area for a base. I almost wish I'd made my base here. It also feels pretty safe. Yeah, I'm pretty sure as long as there's sunlight, I should be able to run this. So let's see. Let's see what's going on out there. There's a wreck down there. 
Let's go find it. I think that might just be the life pod. There was a life pod down here and I did go to it last time. So that's probably what this is. Yeah, it's just the life pod. I've been there. Let's, I hope it can find another one. I gotta turn off those camera markers though. I'm gonna have so many beacons. Actually, you know what? I didn't need the beacon. I'm just now realizing I didn't need the beacon because I can just have one of these camera drones as the beacon for the place. So that was, that was a bit stupid, I won't lie. That's looking like it. I really should have made that extra range module before I came here. And I feel like they might be able to stack. So if I made multiple of them, we'd really be in great shape. But I didn't do that. We're not out of power already, are we? Oh my god, we're out of power already. Emergency power only. Oxygen production offline. God damn it. <laughs> this has just been a series of train wrecks, man. Uh, my base is out of power. There's no oxygen in there. I've been to all the places that it scanned. I'm pretty sure. Um, so I mean... <laughs> I guess that is what it is. I feel like I can't end on that. I feel like I have to end on doing something. That was odd. There's nothing else I can scan for. Oh, fragments. Do I want to scan for fragments then? I found Cyclops stuff over here. Scan for fragments. I'm going to go find them all. There will be progress made. I mean, I did make the gun and I killed some stuff, but I just feel like I haven't really done anything. I'm gonna go scan every single fragment it finds, so that way I stop looking for, like, false, you know, stuff where there isn't any. Like, right here, this is a bulkhead, I think. I'm pretty sure I've already scanned this. We're gonna go scan it anyway. Oh, never mind, it's a Cyclops bridge fragment. Do I have that? No, and no, I do, hell yeah! This crack in the earth here is a bit worrying, I won't lie. Hi, I have no idea what these guys do. I don't know if they kill me. I've never had one attack me, so I just kind of assume they don't. This is a Cyclops hole fragment. That's what I need. I'm straight up gonna have the Cyclops, I think. Probably won't make it today, but I'm gonna have it unlocked. What the hell? You guys saw that, right? I'm not going crazy. There was a fragment. I came over here and it vanished. It literally disappeared. I see it. It's on my HUD. It's right there. And it's gone. But I think I still see it. Yeah, it's still there. So I think they're still there, it's just when I get close to them, they disappear. Or maybe it's because I've already gotten the Cyclops hole. I think it doesn't... It might not scan fragments that you already have, and so when you get close to it, it's like, oh yeah, you already have this, so you don't need to worry about it. But yeah, I mean, it's it's scanned for fragments. I'm really glad that it scans for fragments that you don't have, <laughs> rather than ones that you do. That's, that's really, really handy. But even still, I mean, I don't have... I don't have the Cyclops stuff. And I can't look for anything else that I that I currently don't have or don't need. So, I mean, I guess this scanning room has almost served its purpose. It won't necessarily be completely done because if I need limestone or sandstone, you know, that kind of stuff, more materials, I'll be able to use it that way. But right now, we'll retire this. I really am tempted to continue going. So I think I've made the just objectively bad decision to continue playing. I just put together a bunch of extra resources to hopefully make another scanner room and you know all the stuff that I need for it, hatch, power, that kind of good stuff. I'm gonna head to the alien gun and throw that down. Only thing I'm worried about, you know, alien gun, I'll be able to build the scanner room there, I'll be all ready to go and then the leviathan over there will eat me because I've heard it a lot but there has yet to be a single time I've seen it. And any time that I've heard the Leviathan, I've seen it so far, except for this one. <laughs> That's uh, it's a bit worrying. I don't know if he's like inside of the mountain. There was a cave in there. It makes me really, really worried to explore the cave because maybe the Leviathan's just chilling in the cave. But yeah, the Leviathan's somewhere down there. I don't know where he is. I can only assume he wants to eat me, but I, I just, I don't know where he's at. He could be anywhere. Honestly, maybe this shelf right here might work. Is that the Leviathan? I don't think he's up here. I just hear him. I mean, I could probably chill in my scanner room. There's that teleporty guy that's always over there. 
I'm hoping the teleporty guy does won't like eat my scanner room. That's something I didn't consider. This could this could actually be a real problem. But yeah. There he is. So yeah, the Leviathan's somewhere down that way. I don't actually know where. You wanna do that again for me, buddy? It sounds like he's inside of the wall. I just don't know where he could be. It, it really does sound like he's inside of the wall. That's just gonna constantly stress me out. But yeah, I'm putting it down here. That's Magnetite! What is this doing here? Hey! I'll always take that when I find it. But yeah, I think this is the spot. I think I'm gonna go with here. There's always a real pain in the neck to put this down. There it is, thank God. Leviathan doesn't shut the hell up, man. <laughs> <laughs> constant, constant, Rawr. I get it, man, I get it. You're angry. I gotta kill that thing. I'm gonna go down there with my gun and shoot it. Welcome that would not be a good idea. I really don't like that idea. I'm gonna go with not doing that. I can hear it in here, too. You gotta be kidding me. Reaper Leviathan. <laughs> hey, I can find him. Hey, where are you, buddy? <laughs> you can't be serious. Hey, there he is. <laughs> no way. Reaper Leviathan. That's got to be it, right? That's crazy, dude. How far is he? It's actually so handy. How far is this son of a bitch? Where are we? We're right here. Okay, so he's just on the other side of the island. So we're fine over here. He's chilling on this side, we're chilling on this side. I'm really, you know, I lucked out. Do you have any idea how lucky I am that when I got to the island, I went left instead of right? And you know what I'm also now realizing? Remember that time when I was up on the cliff and I was looking across towards the Aurora and I was like, wow, that's cool. I better not fall in. Well, if I didn't fall in, I'd get eaten by the fucking Reaper Leviathan. <laughs> that's terrifying. I love how it doesn't show a picture. It's like, you don't know what that is. I know what that is, game. I, I figured it out. And you know, I'm looking through here and I can't scan for Rex either, which means that this was a complete and total waste of my time again. <laughs> oh, am I so bad at this? But yeah, I mean, I suppose that's a wrap. I don't have anything else that I was planning to do. This was like my last ditch. I've been playing for too long at this point. I'm editing this down is gonna be a real bitch. But um, yeah, I suppose you can take solace in knowing that I did not get eaten by a Reaper Leviathan today. Have a good one, guys. I'll be back next week.